Right, hello everybody, today I'm gonna show you the Sisigad, I'm assuming that's the right way to say it, hoverboard from Amazon. Just gonna do a brief walk around. Now, this is one of the more affordable hoverboards that you can buy. Um, I got this before Christmas, and I think that I paid $89, but I believe it's regular $99. It's got some nice wheels. These also have some really nice lights um, that uh, turn on once you step aboard. I believe it has, I mean, this is one of your more entry level ones. So it has smaller motors, um, but this is plenty for uh, uh, my son and even myself. Um, I'm 135 pounds, my son, is around 48 pounds he's six years old um however uh we did have to figure it out a little bit um with him being that light this i believe it states that the minimum weight is 42 pounds but with that we learned that he has to be all the way on the outside edges in order for this to work i guess there's a button that's pressed here on the edges that uh makes that happen. But overall, uh, this thing's great. Um, it's very quiet. It's unbelievably quiet. Um, you cannot actually hear it until you actually ride it inside pitch black inside the house here on very smooth tile floors. But if you're riding on concrete or asphalt, I mean, you, you, can't, actually, you can't hear the motors in this thing. Um, since we took it out of the box, we uh, charged it and we calibrated it. It comes with a nice little charger with an indication light. Um, goes in right here. This is how you turn it on. And once it turns on, you hear that tone. So let's go ahead and uh, I'm going to show you guys the lights. And I'm going to try to stay in frame the best that I can. Hopefully, I will be able to do that. Let me adjust this slightly. Okay, so first thing, I'm gonna step aboard and check out these lights as soon as I as soon as I get on board. Look at that, and it actually projects. It's really cool riding at night because um, it projects uh, that pattern onto the ground, kind of. You may be able to see it a little bit on the ground currently. It also lights up on the front, but uh, I mean overall. This thing's great. Um, it's not even, and even spending, you know, an extra forty dollars on one from a department store when you can just get this one. Uh, you know, I don't think you're necessarily going to get anything nice from the department store. The only upgrade you might get is maybe Bluetooth. But honestly, in my opinion, it's really unnecessary. Why does your hoverboard need to be an external speaker? Um, I feel like most of the kids riding these. Um, well, I say this, um, but every kid has a, a cell phone now, but, uh, I mean, it, it's really not necessary. Um, it, uh, it's just a great hoverboard for the price. It's got a nice matte black finish. Um, it does not scratch easily. For instance, we have, you know, flipped this thing over a couple times on asphalt, and whenever it flips over or you fall off, it does this maneuver right here. Just like that, and it might roll over and go back onto the tires. Um, but whenever it does it, it still has yet to scratch. Um, but uh, overall, give this thing a look, guys. I'm going to be posting the link on Amazon, or a link to it on Amazon. It's going to be an affiliate link, so feel free to check it out. Um, make a great present. My kid loves it. Honestly, I love it. Whenever he's not home, just like right now, um, you might just catch me riding it. Um, but overall, give it a look, guys. It might save you 10 or $20, maybe even 40 or $50, rather than going to Target or Walmart and buying one. Um, I know Walmart Black Friday sale, uh, they put it for the same price as this one, and I, I, I don't know, I think this is a nice reward. But uh, give it a look, guys. Thanks for uh, watching, and please like and subscribe to the channel.